If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you are new, and I'll love you forever. Hello there everyone, my name is BDFO18 and welcome back to some more FIFA Mobile. Now today, it's a bit of an interesting episode. I said last night on my stream I have some surprises to show you, and indeed I do. So if you look at the left side of the screen, you would see we have a 100 rated team, 160 chemistry, the best team I've ever had on a FIFA mobile game surpasses my FIFA uh, my FIFA 19 although I had to 95 and 96 rated in that game this overall I'm um, chemistry surpasses my FIFA 19 game let's have a look at it what did I do to get 100 rated well have a look there's one difference can you see him if you can't here he is Danny Cabellos or da Danny Cabellos he was an 86 rated. I got him from the Lunar New Year red envelopes. That's an 86 rated player. And I thought, you know what? His pace isn't as high as Undon Belly and his physical is not as high. But that agility and that passing is so needed. It, he is so creative. I haven't played a prop full match with him yet. But I can only really tell that he's a very creative midfielder. 100 agility and 96 passing is what I need for a card that is playing in centre mid. 100 chemistry. And a hundred and a hundred right overall and 160 chemistry. That is a pretty mental team, man. Obviously, we have Wesley, we have 90 rated Son now, we have 89 rated Grealish. This team is looking fantastic. But today we are going into Lunar New Year. We have four more skill games to complete today, as well as a Zodiac player. And we have four, I believe, red envelopes to get, which could get us at least 600,000 coins, which would upgrade my players and get me prepared for tonight when there are even more rewards coming out. Or do I save my red envelopes until tomorrow? Just in case there's another PL player out. I'm Yes, I'm going to do that. There, there'll be no red envelopes today. We're going to just do skill gains and the Lunar Zodiac card. So, getting into the first uh, skill game, collectibles. I do not enjoy collectibles. Uh, this is probably one of my least favourite skill games. We have to run around here to collect the collectibles. I'm, I, I used to be absolutely rubbish at this. I'm probably going to be rubbish at it again. Let's try it. So, I'm running with the ball. We're dribbling the ball at his feet. Okay, that one wasn't too bad, but normally I really suck at that event. Uh, I failed so many times at that in the past, but we're good. And we get two red envelopes. Yes. Our next skill game is a bricks. That's easy. You've got the, the nine green bricks in the goal. You've just got to shoot the ball towards the goal to get a point. As simple as this. See? As simple as that. You've got to hit four bricks. What the hell happened there? What the hell happened there? I swear that that went I went through the top one, but did it actually go through the crossbar bit? That that is crazy, actually crazy. I do not believe that at all. But regardless, an extra attempt was needed, but we did get all five bricks in the end, or four bricks in the end, I should say. And next we have wall and target. Another 10 lunar points for this. And the next one should give us another two red envelopes, which we'll be doing in tomorrow's video. Where we'll get a... Oh, God. Where we'll get a bigger pack opening for the lunar cards. Hopefully, there's some big rewards in there tonight. Now, I, I've had a look at the lucky shop because I've got over 1,000 lucky coins. And I've got about 1,060 lucky coins at the moment. And... Uh, the player, because it resets every 12 hours, the player is not a good one. It's like an 86 uh, league uncentimeter, I think it is, or a centre back. <clears throat> um, and the rest of it is just skill boost. I'm not, I'm not interested in it. I'm going to save up for like a really high rated PL player. Uh, or maybe even for like 94 rated Delhi Alley, which costs 4,000. I might actually save up for him if I can get him. And there we go. Then after three attempts, we do complete our last skill game. Now let's go and get our Lunar card. Before that, we're going to get our Lunar point reward, which today is 480 more lucky coins. So we have a lot of lucky coins now. I, 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 how many does that put me up to? 
1,540. Right, this is the coin, the, the card for today. So he's 87 rated. Not interested in him at all. At all. Uh, we can actually get Tevez. I want to get Ali. He's a sick card. He, he, he looks so good. But for now, we're going to get ourselves a Luna card. Now, or a, Z a Zodiac point card. Now, Harry Maguire or Mesa Ozil are the two cards that I want to get. Who are we going to get? Let's find out. Luna New Year pack. Here we go. We get Gen A. Okay, no problem. Let's have a look. How good are you? 90 defending, 90 physical, 76 pace, 70 agility. He plays for Getafe in the Liga Santander. I'll have a look at how much he's worth after the video. But until then, I'm just going to keep him in my squad. And if he's not worth much, I'm just going to use him in uh, training. There we go. There we go. So... That is the video for today. So if you've enjoyed the video, don't forget to leave a like, rate, and share, and subscribe to the channel if you want. You're on 115 subs at the moment. Any help towards getting my goal of 125 very soon is always appreciated. I love you forever for that. Not back with a stream tonight. We're streaming tomorrow night, Friday night stream on Grand Turismo Sport. We're doing the Vision Grand Turismo Trophy Plus. And we're back with more FIFA Mobile tomorrow, where we open up the red envelopes and hopefully get ourselves a nice big player or some lantern points they're always important so until then i've been bdfo18 thank you so much for watching the video and i'll see you later